You know, I just heard about this man, Daniel Edmondson, but he's way ahead of my time. Greetings, my fellow artists. Rembrandt here. I'd like to take a moment to tell you about the beautiful paintings you are going to be painting in Daniel Edmondson's 10 DVD, 10 Painting Course. First, we have a beautiful painting of a white bowl with an orange. This painting is so wonderful, and it is going to teach you about balance and eye path through paintings, what advances and what recedes, and what it is that we focus on when we paint. You will also learn a nice little trick on ellipses. Next, we are going to paint the fall pear. This will teach us how to concentrate on one small area and how to bring it to a high degree of finish. We will use that information again later on in the course. Then, we have the watermelon and plums to paint. What a beautifully rich, colorful painting this is. So, this week will be all about color. We are going to learn how to use color and how to take small pieces of color, really pushing to the limit. There is also a great color mixing demo included in this week's video. In week four, we paint beautiful pansies in what I like to call a boat vase. This will teach about advancing and receding planes, and what is background information, and what is foreground information, as we learn how to paint different types of backgrounds. Next is our friend, the Pear Martini. In this DVD, we are going to learn how to focus on a small area and how to paint glass. Glass can be a very elusive thing, but when taught the right way, it is very easy. There is a nice variety of edge work in this painting as well. Then we come along to probably the most difficult painting in the course, but very beautiful. This is the Gerbera Daisy painting. The DVD will demonstrate some very beautiful background work, as well as how to paint these beautiful flowers. Then we come to the painting that we are stealing from the Impressionists. This painting is called Apples and Blossoms. We take beautiful blossoms and paint them in a very painterly loose fashion to get a really beautiful effect and then focus the attention down on the apples. This is a really fun painting. The next painting is a really nice painting to do large. It is called the Asian Vase. There are some beautiful berries on a branch with some oranges. This one really helps teach how to paint great backgrounds. And then, probably one of the most important lessons in the entire course is how to set up your own still life. Up until this point, we have only been painting the still lives that are provided, but this week we'll get a whole lesson on how to set up a still life as well as how to paint composite paintings. After you are done setting it up, send a picture to Daniel and he will critique the setup with some suggestions, and then you paint. Then send the painting in for suggestions too. Then we close off the set of ten paintings with what we call the Jasmine painting. It is made up of these beautiful little flowers in a very nice bluish-green vase with a nice set of grapes and a peach. It is an absolutely exquisite painting, and every one of these paintings in the course has proven to be a good seller, so you should have no problem at all selling these finished works. In doing so, you will end up profiting from this class instead of paying for it. Have a fantastic day, and thank you for spending this time with me in my studio.